Gemini's, my air sign Gemini's. What is up and what is good with y'all? Welcome and welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and clicking on this video. My name is Queen of Wands 1111, you guys. This is going to be your collective love reading, okay? For September 2022, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. Cross watchers, you're also welcome. Okay, keep in mind that you can flip this switch it if you need anything from me, like a private personal reading, or if you want to be generous and donate to my channel. All that information is in the description box down below. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. The more you like, the more... Uh, it allows YouTube to push out this video, okay? So support the channel. It helps me out, and it helps the channel out. All you have to do is like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Turn your post notifications on ALL. Let's get into it. All right. What's coming in for Gemini's for September 2022? What's coming in? Okay, the Knight of Pentacles, yeah. So there's an offer coming in, something long term, but it's coming in slow. I feel like whatever this is that's coming in real slow, it's not coming in at all. You feel something coming in or you feel this coming in. You may not be speaking about this, okay? I feel like you're going to be happy. You're going to be celebrating. You're going to be celebrated, okay? You could be a spiritualist, a tarot reader, or you're into tarot readings. Okay, yeah, you're taking action towards something, Knight of Wands. Yeah, what is this? What is this offer? Why is the Three of Cups here? Could be dealing with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Yeah, a brand new beginning, Ace of Ace of Pentacles. You could be very excited because there's a large lump sum of money coming in. Like this opportunity is big. This is a new home, a new car. This is a night out for dinner and a movie, drinks. This could be a gift. This could be someone coming in very slowly to make you an offer, but they're not telling you that they like you. This person wants to date you. They want to take you out. They want to give you something nice here. Okay, yeah, they want to be in a relationship with you. Okay. Be careful that somebody is not already involved because I'm seeing the Five of Wands and the Two of Pentacles. Now, this can mean two things, okay? People could be jealous and envious of you guys' connection, okay? Um, but I feel like there could be some drama here because somebody can't make a decision or they're juggling or something like that. Let's see. This doesn't have to be the person that you're dealing with. This could be someone else around you. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Or oh, this is you. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Why is the Ace of Pentacles here for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus? Yeah, you're guarded. You're being protected. You're protecting your energy right here. Okay. You're protecting this um this offer, this brand new beginning, this new start. You're protecting it. Yeah, you're in love with someone. Queen of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This is a soulmate connection. Okay, your empress, yeah. This may be someone from the past, like your baby mama or baby daddy. Someone is still, someone is in love with you. Okay, this is someone you know from childhood or someone's returning here or a past situation is, is, is being revisited. Yeah, but you're the empress. This person sees you as their empress. Okay, they want to work with you. They want to work things out with you. Yeah, somebody hates that shit. Somebody hates your work. Somebody hates what you do for work or how you collaborate with other people, work with other people. Somebody's hating on that. Somebody's very jealous and envious. They hate your ideas. This could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This could be another a Gemini, a Libra. They hate your creativity. Mm. What is this? Why is the Empress here? <sighs> yeah, death. Something had to come to an end. Okay, or this is change and transformation. You're making some changes here, or someone has changed. This could be someone from your past that's coming back, okay, that you're really suspicious of. You may not trust this offer, okay? This person wants to show you how much they really mature. They want to provide for you because the King of Pentacles is at the bottom of the deck. Okay, everything you touch turns to gold. So I'm seeing you ending something here. 
okay yeah you're getting another offer or there's an offer coming in or you're paying for some of our services eight of pentacles you're building up your work okay you want to see your work grow you're putting in the work putting in the effort throwing yourself into your work your career here you could be in a job and getting a brand new job with the page of pentacles you could be getting another offer okay yeah somebody's disappointed why is the page of pentacles here who the hell would be disappointed for what why why is the page of pentacles here you may be keeping this a secret you may be keeping this hidden all right you may not be telling anybody what's coming in for you or what has already come in for you let's see why is the page of pentacles here one more shuffle these cards are just flying you guys yeah yeah somebody is stressed yeah somebody um you have another offer coming in so somebody is stressed out okay it's not whatever they're trying to plan it wasn't working okay or their hatred energy towards you they don't understand how protected that you are and it's burdening to someone okay yeah something they don't see coming is coming in for them yeah you're being protected two of swords Ten of Wands. Yeah, that's the truth here with the Ace of Swords. Yeah, things came to light here. Things came out. Clarity, confirmation. Yeah, you're moving on and moving forward. You're being protected here. Six of Swords, Two of Wands. Yeah. They think they have a better plan or they're planning something else, okay? I don't know what they're planning. Let's see, what is this person trying to plan? Two of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sash, Energy. What is this person trying to plan? Spirit, guides, angels, ancestors. What is this person trying to plan? They're trying to plan uh, for you to be in debt, okay? For you to be left out in the cold, for you to be homeless, okay? They're trying to, um, you're going to get through this, okay? Whatever this person is trying to do, it's not going to, it's not working anyway. But I see that, you know, they want you to be left out in the cold. They want you to, uh, have conflict and arguments in your, in your connection, Okay. Because they want to apologize and come back to you. That doesn't make any sense. Make it make sense, okay? They may be jealous and envious over your relationship. They may feel like they have to compete for you or some shit like that. Okay, they may be trying to put on like different outfits or clothes or different colors. That's your favorite. I'm channeling that because they want to reconcile with you. Okay, but this person is going to be out in the, in the fucking cold. This is what I'm seeing. Okay. This person is going to be out in the cold. They may go into financial debt and lose their home. Or, you know, they just been ghosted here. Because whatever they were trying to plan, it's not, it's not working. Alright. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Clarify the Five of Pentacles for Gemini. Okay. Some of you may be celibate. Some of you are not, okay? Yeah. They're trying to make your uh, your new relationship or your new love ghost you, break up with you, leave you out in the cold here. They may have been doing like spells. Sagittarius energy, the moon. Yeah. Yeah, they were doing some sort of witchcraft or some sort of spell work on you. Okay. But I feel like your spirit guides are intervening here in this spell work. Yeah. 
They're all up in their feelings because they see you as the queen of pentacles here. Okay? They see you as somebody who's focused on themselves, who's focused on building a life for themselves, focused on their money, focused on the stability here. Okay? Yeah, this person took you for granted. Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. They took you for granted. Okay, this person may be into prostitution or gold digger or whatever the have you. This person's very codependent. Could be about money because the Nine of Pentacles. I mean, the Queen of Pentacles is here with the Nine of Pentacles. So it could be about money. Yeah, you had to cut their ass off. Yeah, it's over. It's done. <sighs> Yeah, and you're happy. You're getting a new home and you're redecorating or remodeling your home. You're celebrating. Okay, you're very happy. Okay. Yeah. Oh. You may be um, closing out a cycle and moving in with your twin flame or getting engaged or someone that's proposing to you or something like that. All right, or you're proposing to someone because you're in love with someone. You have deep emotions for someone, deep feelings for someone. Or this is how someone feels about you. Let's see, reconciliation here. Yeah, there's a past person right here that's trying to interfere or intervene with what you have going on with this new love. They cannot let you go. They refuse. Okay, reconciliation. They refuse to let you go. They want to heal family issues with you. You may have children with them. All right, they may try to flirt with you and intervene in your connection, okay? Extra friends or family um, for help if you need or your spirit guides, okay? Yeah, you may be getting advice from somebody. You retreated from this person and you freed yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're dealing with somebody that's no good, false person. Okay, maybe this person was trying to like take all your earnings. Yeah, you took them to court. Yeah, they may have concerns, or oh, that was you. One more. One more. Yeah, mature woman. You may be dealing with the older woman, or someone's mother is of significance. There may be children here, too, that's involved. Or a child. You may have been married to this person. Alright, so that is all the messages that I have for you guys for today. Thank you so much for all the love and support. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Turn your post notifications on so you won't miss any readings that I upload for you guys. I love you guys so much. Until next time, bye Gemini. I'll see y'all in the next reading.